Good morning, everyone. It's 6.51 right now. My hair's actually been staying, like, pretty straight. Like, I shaved it, like, a few days ago. And it's been staying straight. Like, I haven't... Like, yesterday, I didn't even really retouch it. It's just... I, I can't really sleep with my hair down. So, I've been, um... Like... Straightening out the bump that it leaves. But then that's it. I kind of want to... I kind of want to use this little headband. Because it low-key matches... Okay, cute. I'm gonna try the. Well, I already tried it, but I'm gonna do the NYX um, brow glue today. Last week I did not wear makeup at all, and I don't know what happened. It, I don't. I don't blame this due to the fact that I didn't wear makeup. I'm just saying, like, I don't think there's no correlation to this. But I didn't wear makeup all last week to school, and I literally broke out like i haven't broken out in so so long and i'm trying to think like what did i put on my face but it could also be because when i don't have makeup on i touch my face a lot and obviously your hands have germs on them no matter how much i like i sanitize them or wash them i touch my face so so much when i don't have um what's it called when i don't have makeup on just because there's nothing really stopping me you know so i don't know if it's because of that or what it is um it's just very annoying <laughs> not even gonna lie you guys i've been wearing makeup this week even though it's like finals and stuff we've been doing like presentations and to be honest i don't know like there's just been there's just like weeks that i really just don't want to wear makeup and i just don't but this week for some reason like i've really been wanting to get ready even though I feel like I probably shouldn't because I'm having my party on Saturday. So, like, to, like, not do my makeup and then do it, like, on Saturday might, like, make me feel better. I don't know. Today, I might just do light makeup, though, because I'm really, I don't think I'm really doing anything today. Like, I'm just prepping for a math final. But also, it's the fact that, like, I, my eyelashes are on their last straw right now. Why did this actually work so good? I'm going to need to buy this again. I literally was debating on buying the NYX brow glue um, at Target yesterday. And I was like, oh, like, I don't really remember if I liked it or not. So, I'm just going to, like, try the rest when I get home and then see if I should buy another one. But that was actually so easy because I've been using got to be but like honestly it's just so annoying having to use that because it's just so messy you know I've been going live a lot recently if you guys are not following me on tiktok you guys definitely should because I definitely do love going live on there for you guys like like just to get ready and stuff and a lot of you guys were asking about my room like saying like oh like where's my pink room um as you guys can see i switched my room around so the pink wall is still there if you guys did not know my whole room was never pink it was only just one wall which is the wall that i'm currently facing right now um but it's just because my vanity used to be against that wall right underneath my tv so everything was switched and i ended up moving my room around because if you guys didn't know um I had a twin bed because I had a day bed and which I didn't have a problem with. I mean, I fit so it wasn't really like a big deal for me to have like a smaller bed. But I decided like I'm getting older, you know, and I kind of wanted a bigger bed. So my day bed actually does pull out. It pulls out into a, a bigger bed. So I ended up pulling my bed out, getting a new mattress, and just moving my whole room around because since my bed was bigger, it like didn't really fit in the space that it was in before. So, and I just wanted like a change. Like I was just like, I just wanted a change. So, I ended up doing that, like deep cleaning my entire room. It was just like a, like a spur of the moment thing too. Like it wasn't even like super like planned to do this. I just decided one day I'm like, oh, I like. I had like an idea in my mind and I was like, okay, I'm just gonna do it. And my mom was like, okay, just like do it. So I did, which I think I like this, um, like this setup a lot better. Um, I still love pink so much guys. Like don't even get me wrong. Like it, it was, it's not a phase, trust me, but it's just like, I'm growing up. I'm like turning 19 and my room was really cute. Well, it still is the same basically, but. 
I'm trying to give myself a more mature look just in all aspects of my life like even with my like clothing like I'm just trying to give myself a more mature look because my room is just like it, it literally looked like a nursery like it looked like a baby's nursery which there's nothing wrong with that like if you like that like i liked it you know for a long time but i just wanted some change and like i said i'm getting older so i just wanted like you know i think for today i'm just gonna add halo glow which some people actually use this as foundation but i feel like it does not give you coverage at all and today I'm gonna need a little coverage because I literally have two pimples on both sides of my face. Um, if you guys already know, I am a, a freshman in college and I'm finishing up my first semester right now. So I'm doing um, I'm doing finals. Like RIP, like finals in college are just so different than finals in high school. Like. Even in high school, I remember like just watching movies. Like, oh my gosh. I'm just gonna add a little bit of foundation because to even out my skin tone. Even though I literally said I wasn't gonna do a full face, but I'm not trust. Just even though this might be some people's full face. Anyway. But I've been super busy with that and just school in general has um kept me busy like this whole like semester. So like my apologies for not like vlogging or whatever or like making video like content for you guys i'm trying to get better though like i kind of learned a little bit how to manage my time a little bit better um but it was also just like always like i didn't have motivation like i didn't really have motivation for even school so it was like it was like really hard for me to find the motivation for this you know um i don't know it's just it's just a lot like sometimes you just want to not do nothing you know when i was live i went live getting ready yesterday and that's what gave me the idea to go live today because i like kind of was at a stump not that like i didn't know what to post like i kind of had an idea but it was like i also didn't have any ideas of like what kind of videos to post and a lot of you guys were telling me like no like you're getting ready with me it's like every like everyone was like commenting on my live because i was like oh like i don't know what to post you know because i've just been going live like i haven't really been filming videos so everyone was like no like i literally go back and rewatch you get right with me like i love you get right with me look here i knew people i knew people like them because like those are the videos that i get the most views on and it's not even about the views it's just like that's how i can see like how much engagement mm -hmm. i have and that's how i can see what you guys like because if i post a video and i don't get a lot of views on it then i know like okay well my audience didn't really like this you know so i know like not to post something like that ever again getting over like a little a little cold right now so a lot of you guys are saying like no you guys did like my get ready with me's and it's because i was getting some messages like i think i got like a few messages on on instagram like saying like i'm sorry but you need to do something different like all you post is get ready with me's which is true but it's just like it's what i like to do at the same time like i'm not a vlogger you know i'm not a vlogger so it's like my i don't that's not the type of content that i post it never really was so it's just like it's like different you know and i understand like you guys do want me to branch out which i understand like i'm, I'm gonna try to like to expand my content but i was never like I never thought of myself to be a vlogger like I always thought myself to be more of like a beauty influencer but I also really like the lifestyle influencing so like Natalie Guedas like I like her videos like a lot um but her life is also um a tad bit more interesting you know so it's just like different but I do want to expand my horizons I just wanted to do this video though because if a lot of you guys have been like watching my get ready with me is like obviously like i love watching people get ready like i love it like me encanta to watch people's get ready with me and like what they end up wearing where they're going and all that so i really like this like gel but like my eyebrows are low-key not sticking up right now i want to get my brows laminated but laminating like i heard it only lasts like literally like a week or something or like a few weeks and it's like it's 
pretty expensive. It's like $100. So it's like $100 per month. On top of my nails that I get like like once every two, three to four weeks. On top of my lashes that I get done every like two weeks. So it's just like, it's just another thing that I would have to pay for. And I don't think I'm really down for that. What? Um, are you going to school? Yeah. Where's mom? Where, mom here today? Mm-hmm. Okay. It's not as pigmented on this side. Okay, anyway. At least the side like the camera's on is the side that my blush looks better because on this side... It's not looking too good. Okay, so now I'm going to do my lip liner. I did my makeup pretty quickly like even while talking I did it in like 20 minutes like this whole video has been 20 minutes so far so I feel like that's pretty good which well it is but it's not because I literally feel like I cannot take my time to do my makeup for the life of me because if me taking my time to do my makeup is 20 minutes like imagine me rushing like I literally just like I cannot like it's like makeup is therapeutic to me, but only for like the 20 minutes, you know? In the middle, I'm just gonna do Dainty Days. My NYX, like it's like a lip cream. I would always do dark, um, dark lipstick because i had no lips you know but yesterday i used um this collab beauty dry shampoo but it was the dark version and it literally stained like even if i go like this to my hair right now like you can see like my fingers got like all black and dirty so my hands are about to get so dirty right now but i got a clear one the clear version so i'm just gonna put this I had like a pimple on my forehead and I put acne medication on it and now my makeup is low key peeling off from right there. Another one hand. I don't know if I should do different earrings or if I just keep these. I'm gonna keep these, but since I gave that out of my ear, I lost an earring bag, so I had a little more lip liner for me to shut up. But I'm gonna go ahead and show you guys my outfit today. It's not that fun, it's kind of basic, but your girl can learn to do so much. My, my outfits have been consisting of just leggings, so if I'm being honest, this is a little different, <clears throat> but I'm gonna wear my junior archer merch it says sinner and then it says sad boys and then the back it says disfruto lo malo and then it says sad boys in the back so there's that and then i'm gonna wear these black cargos everyone always asks where these cargos are from they're from american eagle and then i'm gonna wear my very dirty wait very dirty cdgs because my jacket is Anyway, so I'm gonna get dressed and I'll be right back. Alright, so I just finished getting dressed. Um, it kind of bothers me because my like my cargos are a little bit like washed out. Like they look a little, they don't they're like kind of like an off like off black type of color. Um, and then my jacket's super super black, but it's whatever. This is what the outfit looks like with my shoes. Um, the back of the jacket's really cute at least. I don't really like the headband with this outfit. I feel like it kind of throws it off. I feel like the headband is all like girly vibes and then my outfit is just all emo vibes so it's gonna be this little half up half down and I'm putting half of it in the front so I don't look bald and yeah this is the final look for the day um wish me luck prepping for my freaking math final today and yeah I'll see you guys on 
I'll see you guys in my next video. Bye.